Hey guys, if you if you Hey guys, if you have upgraded to iOS 11, open the calculator app and try pressing 1 plus 2 plus 3. I'm sure you're gonna get a very wrong answer. Let me show you how. So if I open my calculator app and quickly uh, calculate 1 plus 2 plus 3, see, it gives me a wrong. Let me try again. 1 plus 2 plus 3, it's 24. The reason behind is if you type 1 plus there's a small bit of animation which uh, doesn't register your second click so you have to wait for the animation to get over and then slowly type in plus three and that's how you get the correct answer so i thought why not go to settings and there's a toggle reduce motion so i thought just toggle that off and see if there's any changes or will that fix the calculator app so this is how i did it so i went to the settings sorry so I went to the settings app under general and uh, you can see this accessibility and uh, you'll find an option called reduce motion. So if you just click this it reduces the motion. So there are no motion uh, transitions if you close or open any app. So you can see uh, there's no animation there. So let's check if the calculator uh, problem is, is fixed or not. So I went to the calculator app and let me try 1 plus 2 plus 3. Oh no it's not fixed uh, the animations are still here come on apple please fix this we need to fix this in the next update please do that so yeah there is no particular solution for this calculator app in apple so there is only one solution for it download another third party calculator known as super calculator it is one of the best and let me just show you a small glimpse of it so i have this app called super calculator it is a free app on the app store so let us check this out unfortunately this doesn't work on the landscape mode so let me try 1 plus 2 plus 3 1 plus 2 plus 3 see it gives a proper result so this is the only alternate solution for your ios 11 calculation